Good morning, everyone. Today I'm sharing with you my nine to five morning routine. So this is my ideal morning routine for days that I am going into the office. And for me, I feel like the best way for a peaceful and productive non-rushed morning routine is to wake up fairly early around six or 7 a.m. So I have plenty of time to do all of the morning things that I like to do. So on this particular day, I woke up around six. And the first thing that I did was read my book. So I've been getting back into reading. I've always been a huge reader ever since I was a kid. And I have read some really great books recently, which I feel like sparked my interest back into reading again. And on this morning, I started Normal People, which I've heard great things about, but I will come back to you guys with my full review once I finish the book. But I do a little bit of light reading, probably no more than like 15 minutes, just a little bit of something to kind of get myself off my phone in the morning because I feel like that's a habit that I'm trying to break. So after that, I'll make the bed, get dressed, brush my teeth and get into some comfy clothing because I like to move my body at least some point during the day. And it honestly differs from day to day. Some days I will go to a workout class after work. Other days I'll go for a short walk during my lunch break. And today I decided to do a Pilates YouTube workout. I believe this one was around 30 minutes long. And I really find that I tend to thrive with low intensity workouts like Pilates, yoga, going on long walks and things like that. I'm still working on finding a workout routine that is best suited for me. I feel like I have several workouts that I really enjoy and so right now I'm just figuring out what frequency and which days and which time of day works best for me. So if you have any recommendations or advice on that, feel free to leave it in the comments. Most mornings I will focus on workouts that are pretty low intensity and just try to get a good stretch in. In this newest stage of life, starting my first job, I have been thinking a lot about my career goals and how to continuously grow personally and professionally. And I'm really excited to be partnering with Skillshare on today's video to share how I'm working towards that. Right now, I would say my biggest goals are in the areas of productivity, time management, and also overall creativity. This class I took was specifically about silencing your inner critic, and I just found it really, really interesting and insightful. And there were other classes that were specifically targeted towards organization and workflow tips for content creators or exercises to help reconnect with your inner creativity. So I just thought this was really cool. And I have used Skillshare in the past for all kinds of photography, editing, and other creative courses, but these career and personal growth focused courses are really helpful for this stage of life that I'm in. And I have a great offer for the people who are watching today's video. The first 1000 people to use the link in my description box will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. So thank you so much Skillshare for partnering with me today. At this point in the morning, I am definitely getting very hungry and I often will just cook my breakfast at home. It's definitely the easiest, but Germany has amazing bakeries, delicious bread, and it's also a really nice walk around in the mornings when things aren't too busy. So on this day, even though it was raining, I decided to walk over to one of my favorite bakeries in Munich. This is a really popular one because they have really delicious breads. So sometimes I will get a loaf of bread and eat that throughout the week for a sandwiches or toasts and things like that. So today I just grabbed a smaller bread and then just ate it on the way home. And by the time I got home, it was time for me to start getting ready for my work day. So I did my whole skincare routine, which I didn't show on camera, but let me know if you guys would be interested in me talking a little bit more about my skincare routine. It's quite simple as I've showed it a few times before on my channel, though I did recently add a few new products. I added a hyaluronic acid serum and also a sunscreen, which I have been wearing sunscreen before, but I'm trying a new sunscreen and I really like it. And I honestly have been getting so into skincare care because I'm really seeing some great results from it. But anyway, I will usually just do some light makeup for the office, usually some concealer, powder, some cream blush, and clear eyebrow gel, mascara, lip gloss, sometimes eyeshadow and eyeliner, but overall pretty simple. Some days if I'm feeling it, I'll go more glam and curl my hair, do my full makeup routine and all of that. So next time I do that, I'll be sure to film it for a vlog and do kind of like a get ready with me because I feel like those are really fun. I also love to watch those. But this was my routine for this day and I decided that I wanted to straighten my hair on this day, so I did that as well. My hair is already naturally mostly straight. It just kind of, as you can see, likes to flip out sometimes on the ends, so I'll usually just quickly run the flat iron through it and smooth it out a little bit. And this probably takes about five to 10 minutes. It's honestly not too long. 
I will usually allocate about half an hour for my whole getting ready routine. I feel like I've got it down to like a solid 30 minutes. Obviously, sometimes it takes more if I'm doing curls in my hair, if I'm doing more makeup. But on days like these, it usually only takes about 30 minutes. And on this day, I decided to put a little bit of argan oil in my hair just for a little bit of added shine and hydration. And then I was pretty much ready to go. So I just picked out my outfit for the day. On this day, I wore a navy blue polka dot dress, my new balances, and a white blazer. And I really liked this fit. I thought it was cute. I had my little necklace and my bracelet and then I headed out and I started my commute to work. And I would also like to stress that not every day is the same. For example, on this day, I decided to stop by another bakery and this place has really great options for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And I felt that I was in need of a little added vitamin C. So I picked up this juice, which has apple, orange, and ginger. This one was really good. It had a lot of ginger, but I like this drink a lot and yeah, I happen to be running early on this day, so that's why I stopped for a juice. Some days I will go and get a coffee with a colleague or just head straight into the office. But yeah, that is an example of my ideal morning routine for 9 to 5. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye!